What's up YouTube, Elfley here back with a new video. Uh Road to twenty Premier League teams we begin uh with Villa. This is the Aston Villa's first attempt. With back to back uh cup victories with Arsenal, it's Villa's turn to get going and this video should have been up on Friday but I realised that if I leave it to Friday to play the match I won't get it done. So I'll have to play the match Thursday and upload it Friday. So in future the uh First team, like the first chance for every team will be on a Friday and then uh, the second time will be on the Monday or Tuesday. So just clear that up there and we'll begin with buying our first player for the Blackburn team. Alright, so this is who we buy. We buy uh, Paul Robinson. He, there was really only one choice. It wasn't a difficult option. So we buy Paul Robinson for 1,100 coins. Uh, good goalkeeper, good price. I was placed for 1,100 and... Um, Please with that start uh, to the Blackman team. So we progress to the first game and I love playing against these teams. Very low chemistry, we just random players from random leagues jolted about. He's got Mickley there who's quite good but I just love it. I just find the team kind of play it together or anything. So here we go anyway. Uh, yeah, here's the first goal so Nzogby with a nice bit of skill shown uh, his pace. Uh, Pulls off the McGeady spin for like the four star skillers because obviously they can't do the proper McGeady spin, so they do that. And it was a good turn, good finish with his left foot. Uh, I'm not complaining about that. And again, Jermaine G, I think it was Jermaine Janus with a good tackle, a few step overs there, and just finessing that into the bottom right hand corner for the uh, 2 0 up, 2 0 up uh, within 25 minutes. Again, on the attack, Mark Albright this time with a nice roulette there to get past his. Right back, good cross into Bent, and Bent, the poacher, knocking that into the net with his head, he pierce, good shooting, good heading, good all round strike for Darren Bent, recommend him. Uh, fourth time, fourth goal, sorry, a uh, bit of a collision there between uh, the striker and the centre half, but cheeky chip there from Gabby Bon Lahore, making it 4 0 and doing a bit of a, <laughs> bit of a rude celebration. <laughs> Uh, but never mind, that's uh, 4 0. He's 5. Uh, uh, I'm not too sure what happened there. I meant to do a step over and knock it round to the goalkeeper's right, but Ben didn't do that. He just left the ball, and his goalkeeper was in no man's land, really, and just <laughs> basically dummied him and just ran through for the easy tap in. And I'm not too sure about this goal. His goalkeeper did get the ball, but in the first half, I was one on one and I took around his goalkeeper and he brought him down, didn't get sent off, so that redeems it I think and uh and Zogby there getting laid off and just striking it in at the back of the net for six. And that's how it finishes. Six. Yeah, six nil, absolutely champion, as you say. I love playing against some teams with poor chemistry. I find it just so easy. They just don't work together as a team or anything. So yeah, we'll have that. We'll have a six nil victory going into the going into the cup. With our heads held high there. So he's the uh, left back I buy. There's no other left back option. So I've had to pay an extortionate price for him. Uh, 86 pairs being a silver. But I suppose by the time I get all 20 teams, I'll have a few silvers. So I could make a silver's team and he would fit nicely in it. So uh, plenty of options. So yeah, I, I, I didn't mind that signing for 1,900. So we'll move on to this team now. And this is the team we play against. Uh, a uh, few good players, uh, Lorente there, upgraded silver, but could have just sold him, got normal silver, and then got Torres or something, but it's up here. So this was a really, really, really difficult game, as you can see, and Zogby, a first time shot into the top corner. Pass Casillas, absolutely stunning strike, but literally that's it. 1-0, it was so difficult, it was end-to-end. -end. It was a brilliant match, it was end-to-end -end and good for a 1-0, but... As you say there, I, I did get the decisive goal. It was a brilliant strike, and indeed that won me a game. So there, seven goals in the last two matches. So not bad. And this is the centre back that we bought. And I apologise, I forgot to hit record when I bought him. Looked, it was a bit gutted. So I sent him back to my trade bell, so you can all see him. And it's Dan, uh, one thousand exactly. So that's not bad. And uh, I had my next centre back in mind. It was just getting this one. I, was, I bought him over Givre, I think it was in the end, so I was happy with that. So we'll move on to this team now, the semi-final. 
And just look at that team. I mean, look at the defence. Five at the back. Chiellini, Thiago Silva, Lucio, Mike on Taiwo. And then look at the midfield. Oh my, it was, this is the most difficult, one of the most difficult games I've actually ever played on FIFA. Never mind the series, but we scramble the first goal and it is a beauty. It is a beauty. Bent turns, smashing it into the top corner. I don't know if it goes off the post in or it's that hard. It just hits the... It hits the uh, side net and goes in, but that's it. Another 1-0, another scramble 1-0. And this guy actually did send me hate mail. That's why I haven't just had to skip there. He did send me hate mail because I knocked him out and he wasn't happy. But I was, and I went to the final. But, you know, he called me a pace abusing, but <laughs> I don't know. So we'll continue. And this is who I get for the centre back. And if you look there, maximum price of 10 grand. I don't know if this is an absolute bargain, but. There's only three up, and the cheapest one was a 1,000, and in the same formation I was looking for. So I snatched them up. I don't know if that's going to be brilliant, but there we go. And I'm in full confidence going in this final now, so bring it on. So this is the team we play in the final. I mean, it's outstanding. I don't know if I always get these hard teams. I don't know if it's because I'm playing with Villa that... I don't know that... Uh, these teams seem so good or oh, they actually are really good I'm not too sure but he gets the opener there which uh, not very pleasing but you know and this is a defence mistake I think he waits too long to bring that centre back out I think you've got to bring him out earlier or leave him in there he brings him out and Janus punishes that and gets a goal and that's an equaliser that was a big goal in this but so unfortunate, he manages to go up and score again. Uh, here we go. Defence splitting pass. And if his defending was bad, this is atrocious. Get caught out there and just... Oh, it's really poor. And he punishes me with 14 minutes left. I'm wondering, can I do it? Can I do it? But no, that's it. Um, I apologise, I've been knocked out, so... That was a 12 game win streak there, just come to a loss. Uh, 8 with Arsenal and then 3 here, you're going into the final. Nearly done the treble of uh, 3 in a row, but you can't win them all, so unfortunately we didn't win We didn't win this one. So hopefully we win it next time and get a better go. So he's the player we purchased. I think it's Bradley or I think it's Bradley or and we get him for a nice, a very low cost there. I think, I think it was 350 or 300. So we have that, I'm pleased with that, and we, that's the. That's the back four and the goalkeeper bought and so far it's looking good. I have no complaints about some players there. Uh, it's mainly looking good so that's that. And as you all know at the end of every episode I like to go over a few features such as the top goal scorer and how I rate the team on five. And I'm just going to add uh, two more features as well because we all like to. It's just going to be loads of stats at the end of the video. It's just going to have lots of stats so if you support this team just see if you agree with us or not uh, and this is what I found out and the two stats that is going to be coming in is best player and best unexpected player so for example we'll go back to Arsenal and the best player who wins that is Robin Van Persie uh, mainly because he's just a machine on here I had the, I had the upgraded version and he was a beast uh, absolutely brilliant and the best unexpected player, I'm going to go with Alex Song. Yeah, I didn't think he'd be that good, but he was a tank. He was just there for everything. So good, so strong, uh, powerful passing. He can shoot. Very, very good. He can defend. He can do everything. So that's that. Um, I've got a few ideas who Villas is going to be the best players in that. And but and the top goal scorer for Villas is a bit confusing because I think Enzogbi has chipped in more than... I thought he would, so he's done well there. Uh, yeah, so quite pleased with that. Uh, in the description, I'll put all the Arsenal stats again. I'll just keep going through every team as we get there. So by the time we at Wigan, the description is going to be about <laughs> 12 foot long or something. So yeah, that's it. Uh, that's pretty much it for this episode. Anything else? I think that, no, I think that's all pretty much cleared. So hopefully we'll win it next time anyway. So this has been hopefully. Uh, please drop a like, please subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you later.